Alan Hamel. The spouse of Susan Summers sheds tears as he talks about her last road trip, his vision following her passing, and the vow he made to the Three's company actor. One day shy of turning 77, on October 15th, Susan Summers, star of Three's company, passed suddenly in Palm Springs, California, at the age of 76. Her spouse Alan Hamel has now discussed her final days after losing her fight with breast cancer in an exclusive interview with DailyMail.com. With tears in his eyes, he said, We shared a last kiss, and it was beautiful and passionate. The 87-year-old producer and actor also discussed their most recent road adventure, which took them through Utah and Nevada on their way from Illinois to California. She enjoyed taking in the scenery, he said. And he revealed that, a few days after his wife's death, he got a vision of her, a blonde bombshell. She was staring at me when I reached out for her hand in bed alone and she was half asleep. He said, it felt like she was there. The TV producer then shared details of their unusual Hollywood romance, including how they first met and fell in love on a houseboat in the 1960s. She lived in the hippie community of Sausalito, she fit right in, he remarked, pointing to her bell-adorned anklet. He also disclosed her final request, she asked me to carry on with her company and provide organic products to her ladies, as she referred to them. He continued, she wanted her clients to have the best. Missing Susan may not be a strong enough word, I'm not sure what it is. However, we haven't even spent one hour apart over the previous 55 years, he revealed to DailyMail.com. Even though we lived in the same house, Susan and I were so close that she stated she would miss me and I would miss her when I wasn't in the room. It was really special to me that we would actually fall asleep holding each other's hands, he added. He then added, I do believe in the afterlife, I've met mediums in the past, and they've told me things that I could never have known. It's nice to know that there are a lot of accounts of individuals dying, returning, and sharing tales, the possibility of Susan and I crossing paths again is not negligible.